Constantine VIII Greek, Constantinos e Constantinos VIII 960 November 1028 was the Byzantine emperor from 15 December 1025 until his death in 1028. He was the son of Emperor Romanos II and Empress Theophano. He was nominal co-emperor for 63 years from 962, successively with his father, his stepfather Nikephoros II Phocas, his uncle John I Zimiscus, and his elder brother Basil II. Basil II died childless in 1025 and thus left the rule of the Byzantine Empire in Constantine's hands. Constantine had no interest in politics, statecraft or the military. His brief reign is said to have been an unmitigated disaster, sparking a collapse of the military power of the empire. Topic: <laughs> <laughs> Family Constantine's father, Romanos II, was the sixth Byzantine emperor of the Macedonian dynasty. After the death of his first wife, Bertha, who took the name Eudocia, daughter of Hugh of Arles, he fell in love with and married an innkeeper's daughter from the Peloponnese, Theophano. Contemporaries called Theophano the most beautiful woman in Christendom as well as ambitious, an inveterate schemer and utterly amoral. She bore Romano's four children, including Constantine, born in 960, and his elder brother Basil, born in 958. His sister Anna's hand was considered such a prize that Vladimir I of Kiev converted to Christianity in order to marry her. Aged eight, Constantine was engaged to a daughter of Emperor Boris II of Bulgaria but in the end he married a Byzantine aristocrat named Helena, daughter of Alypius. By Helena he had three daughters, Eudokia, who became a nun, Zoe, who was empress for 22 years, and Theodora, who reigned for 18 months and was the last of the Macedonian line. Life Childhood <inaudible> 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 Romanos died in 963, amidst rumors that Theophano had poisoned him. Constantine was three years old. Constantine and his brother had been crowned co emperors by their father in March 962. The widowed Theophano installed herself as regent for her sons and promptly purged the imperial government, appointing her own men. Passing over a bevy of suitors among Constantinople's courtiers, she made an alliance with Nikephoros Phocas. Nikephoros, a physically repulsive ascetic twice her age, was the greatest military hero of the empire. In return for her hand, the childless Nikephoros gave his sacred pledge to protect her children and their interests. Nikephoros entered Constantinople three months after Romano's death, breaking the resistance of Joseph Bringas, a eunuch palace official who had been Romano's chief counselor, in street fighting. Nikephoros was crowned emperor in the presence of his nominal co-emperors, Constantine and Basil. A month later he married their mother, six years later, Nikephoros was murdered at Theophano's instigation and her lover and co-conspirator John Zimiscus was acclaimed emperor. Zimiscus proposed to marry Theophano but the empress had by then been too damaged by gossip and rumors, many of them accurate. Patriarch Polyuctos refused to perform the coronation unless Zimiscus removed the Scarlet Empress from the court. Zimiscus calculated that his legitimacy would be better enhanced by church approval than betrothal to the unpopular empress and acceded to the patriarch's demands. Theophano was sent into exile and Zimiscus was crowned, again with Constantine and Basil as co-emperors. He married Theodora, Constantine's aunt. <laughs> Adulthood Following the death of Zimiscus in January 976, Basil and Constantine took power. Although the 16-year-old Constantine was nominally co-emperor it was clear that Basil was senior emperor as Basilus Basil II. Constantine as a young man was tall and graceful, he was a superb horseman and trained his own horses. He competed in athletic and wrestling competitions, which he brought back into fashion. He had an excellent speaking voice and a good grasp of rhetoric. He was a gourmet and a gourmand. He had no interest in politics, statecraft or the military and never developed any. Constantine led troops alongside his brother in 989, the campaign ended without any combat and Constantine was not appointed to military command again. <laughs> 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 
Topic: <inaudible> Emperor. Basil II had an illustrious reign, earning the sobriquet Bulgar Slayer, Bulgaric he died childless on 15 December 1025 and Constantine, a 65-year-old widower, became sole emperor as Constantine VIII. He had been a co-emperor for 63 years but had always been content to enjoy the privileges of imperial status, without concerning himself with state affairs. He spent his life in the search of pleasure and entertainment, or amusing himself with riding and hunting. He was of frivolous disposition, he desired nothing more than to pass his life wallowing in extravagant pleasures." Constantine as emperor carried on as he always had, hunting, feasting, and enjoying life, and avoided state business as much as possible. By the time he became emperor he had chronic gout and could hardly walk. He met challenges with impulsive cruelty, persecuting the nobility and ordering an orgy of torture. Blinding was a favored punishment for crimes real or imagined. He filled the senior court and state positions with nonentities. Within months the land laws of Basil II were dropped, under pressure from the Anatolian aristocracy. Devoid of any semblance of moral fiber, he would grant any concession. Favoritism failed to win him friends and he persecuted the nobility when he felt threatened by conspiracy. The start of the decline of the Byzantine Empire has been linked to Constantine's accession to the throne. His reign has been described as an unmitigated disaster a break-up of the system," and causing a collapse of the military power of the empire. He ruled for less than three years before his death on of November 1028. On his deathbed, and without a male heir, Constantine recalled the senior aristocrat Constantine de Lesenos, Duke of Antioch, to the capital in order to marry his oldest daughter Zoe. The de Lassenus were one of the few powerful patrician families who had been unswervingly loyal to the Macedonian dynasty. Constantine Dalasinos set out from his estates in the Armeniac theme, but before reaching Constantinople the situation changed, the emperor's advisers preferred a weak ruler whom they could control, and, typically, Constantine was persuaded. He chose Romanos Argyros instead, forcing him to divorce his wife and marry Zoe. The wedding took place only three days before Constantine died on of November 1028. Romanos was crowned Romanos III, R. 1028 to 1034, four days later. Topic: Ancestry. Topic: See also. List of Byzantine emperors. Equals equals notes. <laughs>